The first mark is if we remain tranquil when our undertaking has not been successful. For we know that God does not demand an account of the success or failure of our undertaking, but of the purity of our intention. Did it have the desired outcome? Or did it have the right intention behind it? Number two, rejoice at the good done by others. If we seek nothing but the divine glory, we shall not care whether it is promoted by another or by ourselves. And three is not to seek praise from others. The third mark is not to desire approbation of our good works nor gratitude from them, but to remain even when censured and maltreated in our usual tranquility of mind, satisfied at having succeeded in pleasing God.